Let's see if this is OSHA approved headgear. All right, we have, oh God, <laughs> it did very little. I'm gonna be honest, that did barely anything to protect his skull. Oh my goodness, his entire skull just broke off. All right, so let's go ahead and see if my secondary design here for a helmet is more effective than the first. I'm not expecting him to survive this um, because obviously this is a very thin helmet and even though I did a little bit of design to make it safer, I mean, this is a giant steel ball moving very quickly, so... Oh, but look! Immediately we notice a difference. This helmet is squishing downwards. It's, it's squishing instead of just moving into his skull. It's absorbing some of that energy. And you can see that the pad is trying to do its best at moving that force down without actually killing him. I mean, th the skin is definitely getting compressed. We got some bruising, actually? Guys, the skull, the skull did not break. Like, yes, his head, his skin just got torn, but did you see that? That was awesome! He, he actually, he actually didn't die!